When you're working toward your weight loss goal, moving efficiently and working your entire body is key. This routine focuses on toning your total body, keeping yourself challenged and on your way toward your fitness goals. So let's get started. You're gonna start in your downward dog and spread your fingers nice and wide here. Take a few long, deep breaths into your heels. And you're gonna breathe your right leg all the way up and back coming into your downward dog split. Just open up your hips for this one. And you're gonna lower your left forearm down to the ground. Go ahead and take a peek under your right arm. You can press your whole left foot down to the ground here, really getting the opening all the way up the backs of your legs here. And then go ahead and straighten both arms out, just squaring off your hips, lifting the back of your leg up to the ceiling, coming into your downward dog split. And then just go ahead and bring your knee all the way up and forward, coming into your low lunge. And keeping your hips nice and low, start to bring your shoulders on your back, just bring yourself all the way up to your high lunge. And you're gonna move forward to your warrior three, so bringing your torso parallel to the ground, just like somebody's pulling your arms, start to shift your weight right over that right leg, lift your back leg up even with your hips, take a couple easy breaths here. And you're gonna come over to your standing split, so bringing your fingertips down, dropping the weight of your head, opening your hips, lift your top leg a little higher. And you're gonna roll up to your tree pose. So this one, bend both knees, just use your stomach. This takes a lot of coordination and focus here to bring it all the way back up, so just keep it moving easy. And go ahead and grab a hold of your ankle. Just bring that foot right up into your tree pose. Take a couple easy breaths in your tree. If you want to reach your arms up, go ahead and try that. And then just go ahead and hug your knee all the way back into your chest, stepping down with that right foot. And you're going to bring it all the way back to your standing split again, taking lots of coordination. Try to move really efficiently here, bringing your fingertips down, dropping the weight of your head, breathing easy here. And then three times, you're gonna softly bend both knees, bring your back knee to the outside of your front foot, coming down to a squat here, almost to a seated position, but instead of sitting down, you're gonna press all the way back up. Try to use only what you need to stay in the movements here. Again, lifting all the way up to go down. And then pressing down to bring yourself all the way up. And then last one, lifting all the way up. Lift up in your belly to go down, to keep it nice and easy here and pressing down to bring yourself all the way up. And you're gonna re-bend your right leg, reach your left leg all the way back behind you to your low lunge. Press your palms down, you're gonna step yourself back to your plank pose here, lifting the backs of your legs up to the ceiling. And for this one, you can do with your knees up, or your knees down, we're gonna do a couple, just lowering and raising up here. So bend your elbows halfway out, nice and strong in the stomach, and push it all the way back up. Just try to stay with the breath here again, lowering halfway down. And pushing straight back up. And then last one, lowering halfway down. We'll move it through your upper dog. So just rolling your shoulders down your back. Breathe your chest through your arms. Take a little bit of a breather here. If it feels good to sway a little side to side, you can try that opening up your body. And then gently bring yourself all the way back to your downward dog, taking a few breaths into your heels. And then you're gonna try that whole thing on the left side and then twice more, so right, left, right, and left. It will really engage your total body, get you nice and toned, challenging your muscles and challenging your mind.